Hi everyone, it's Ginny. I'm back today to show you some happy mail that I got and um, also a, a prize that I won. So I'll start with a little bit of happy mail. This is from Amanda Christina who is Heavenly Imaginings on YouTube. Now she sent this to me several months ago. I'm sorry Amanda, I was very slack in getting around to showing this, but I did thank you. Um, so yeah, Amanda Christina makes the most adorable mini things and she sends, I might bump you in a bit, she sends us little crafty people her um, little gifts of things that she's made or this is little um, either punched or die cut little bows in different craft papers and some mini envelopes that you fold up yourself. I really like miniature stuff too. That's really cute little embellishment that she's made with a heart and some bling and a flower. More tiny tiny envelopes can you see how tiny that one is there it's so cute <laughs> and some little hearts whoops you where am i going <laughs> yeah little hearts in different craft papers some of them are glittery and some are shiny and some little banners nice. Wishing you a full heart. This little note, yes. Just a wee happy mail. Late love day mail. Biggest hugs, Amanda. Oh, that's lovely. Thank you. And this little, I think what you call a loaded pocket. Look at that. Gorgeous tiny little flowers. Oops, they got a bit squashed, I think, in the mail. It's a cute little butterfly there. And then it's got these little pockets and she's put things inside. I think this is from Valentine's Day. Loves me not, loves me. Some nice papers. it right through oh dear and this one's a little oh look what she's done whoops she's made embellishments by using all the little things that she sent me and put them together so she's got a little envelope with a bow on the front and it's stuffed full of hearts <laughs> that's gorgeous I really like that and there are others behind Oh, really nice. Great to use in journals or other crafty projects. Here's a little pad of papers. Oops, I missed one. <laughs> Chocolate, sweetheart, kiss and yours. Pretty hearts. Very nice. Oh, keeps falling out. And she's got a little card here with some washi tape. Lovely glittery hearts, some stripes and purple. That's really nice, shiny. And this is a special little thing she made for the Christmas. Um, challenge I think last year season's greetings and look it opens up isn't that fabulous little box <laughs> it's really good it's just folded in the way that it opens up and inside is a little Christmas tree ornament or embellishment and oops 
a little sleeve, <coughs> excuse me, a little sleeve with a little card in it. Wonderful, lovely, beautiful, happy mail. Thank you so much, Amanda Christina. I love everything. I've got quite a collection of um, beautiful little gifts that you've sent me over the past few years. I need to get into my room and use them. <laughs> okay, so that's that one. Thank you, Amanda Christina. I'll give you a kiss Mwah! and a hug. Oh, be close. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay, so the next thing is um, from Alexis and Melinda's art space. Um, they had a, a challenge for their birthday. Sorry, I'm just opening a big envelope off camera because I want to cover up the address. But yeah, they had a challenge and they asked us to send in um, some peacock things for Melinda to make a peacock journal and some bunny things for Alexis to make a bunny journal. And if I didn't mention, they are Alexis and Melinda Art Space on YouTube. That's their channel, mother and daughter channel. Oh gosh, I'm having such a time <laughs> trying to open this. So anyway, um, they had a few entries and they ended up doing a draw a few weeks ago. And... They ended up giving everybody who entered um, a little prize. So first two prizes, I think, were a little bit more significant. But um, mine was a voucher for ten dollars off at it to spend in the exhibit store. So I went along and made an order. And I ordered a couple of extra things as well. So this is it. I've got some fabulous pay envelopes. I used to have pay envelopes like this many years ago and I worked in the supermarket, but they weren't as big as this. These are really good. So it'll be great for journaling. I've got some purple tickets, admit one. So, I'm not sure what these are, receipt papers maybe or order. I can't remember. <laughs> but they look good and they'd be great for journaling. You can colour them or, or maybe they're raffle, raffle tickets because yeah you tear the number off really good and some of these handmade embellishments that Melinda's made <coughs> excuse me again with my throat I got some that she's just stitched little um, pockets made out of maps which I really like they're really colourful and handy I love the really sort of rustic torn paper and threads hanging off and it's got two pockets there. And where's that? Bateman's Bay. And another one. A couple of pockets. And then I've got some envelopes that she's decorated and stitched. Um, bags, I mean, brown paper bags. And she's made pockets as well. So I've got two of those really nice <clears throat> and two of these smaller ones little embellishments and I think they go this way yes love the feathers that's a really nice die cut Melinda and she stitched it different colors to the others so that's that and 
Ooh. An envelope and a card that um, she's stitched and covered in plastic and it's a little um, native dried flowers arrangement. Isn't that beautiful? Really nice. I like how you've put the plastic over to protect it. That's a really good idea. And a nice natural, looks like handmade paper envelope. Some little threads in it. So that's that and I got some napkins. And I got these napkins with um, a particular journal in mind. So I chose colours that are bright and jazzy and have a bit of gold in them. So this one, let's see if I eventually get around to <laughs> making. I've got so many plans. Um, there's never enough time in the days there. Especially when you've got other things that need to be done as well. So it's this one, it's really lovely flowers, the gold border. Oh. So two, two of each of the um, patterned ones. This one, I love the really bright jazzy pattern as well as the colour. Really nice. And then I've got a black and white one. Flowers. That's the same all over, so I won't open that up. And some gold floral pattern. And florals with a black background. And who oh, feathers? I love feathers. Peacock feathers in pink. Really pretty. And another jazzy one. I'll show you this. Open it up. Oh, look at that. Isn't that great? What I'm thinking of is a boho journal. So I thought, you know, bright jazzy and bits of gold and red as well. I don't know how it's going to work out but <laughs> I have some ideas. So there's that one with the pattern border and some embellishments. Sticker sheets not embellishments. Oh wow, there's lots. Oh wow, there's more than I thought there was going to be. And they're the same. And these are slightly different. Ooh, great. And there's another set. Is that the same as the others? No. Oh, they're similar because they're the same colour scheme. Hmm, fabulous. And Melinda always sends this awesome thick chipboard in um, the stuff that she sends out, which I find really useful. So that's all of that. Thank you very much, Melinda. That got to me really quickly. And um, yay, I'm really happy to have it. Thank you so much for the prize of the voucher. And yeah. Awesome. Uh, kisses Mwah! and hugs to you and Alexis and I hope you're both doing well because I know you've been not doing too well health wise lately so hugs of healing to you both. Alright that's all of it. Thanks everyone else for watching and I'll be back soon to show you some more 100 things challenge stuff that I've made so bye for now. Thank you.